Welcome to Passport TV. Harry Dick here with you. I hope everybody is doing well. What we have here is a recording of the perverted old orange-haired creep issuing his apology for insulting the Filipino wife of an American. Because that's bringing myself to some other people's level and I don't really want to bring myself to that level. This is something that I actually fight against. I will definitely apologize to you on that respect. So I will be a bigger man and I will apologize on that respect. That's about it. What did the old pervert say to apologize for? Let's listen. So the way you're going to get a fucking woman is a buyer. What kind of bimbo did you find that would marry you? You need money that bad? Is that how you bought your dime store ring for your bimbo? Any woman that'll be with you got to be a fucking bimbo or for money or something. And whoever is that bimbo that decided to get together with you, fucking A, man. She's got to live with you. Yes, of course. He's trying to avoid that level. But let's listen to the level that the creep has been on for the past seven or eight years now. Let's listen. Let's listen. Don't mind what Dave says or anybody else. Fuck him. Screwball. And his wife is a fat sow, by the way. How do you like that? I said it, Dave. Your wife's a fat sow. She's an ugly pig. She's with you for the fucking money. How do you like that, Dave? And you're a lousy father. And you don't mind me talking about your sow, that ugly bitch that you have as a wife, the bar girl, the teenager you got together with and you uh, defiled her. You want to get that low, huh? Okay, well, let's get even with this. Your wife is an ugly, short, fat bar girl that you met when she was a teenager. You like young children. I feel sorry for your child because you may possibly do something with her. Wow, what a level to be on. Insulting Filipinas and labeling people as pedophiles. Wowzer. We have an aspiring pole dancer here on our own YouTube uh, community here that uh, really needs a pole because her boyfriend cannot afford to buy her that pole. Now, you see, they make their money on their show by this woman doing her little theatrics on her show because her boyfriend cannot afford to upkeep her. And one of the ways of creating money uh, after failed attempts to have a business is to put her his woman on camera and uh, entertain the gentleman. And this is the guy who goes running off to file cases against people. I'm dimples. I'm dimples. Dumples, yeah, dumples. She probably got some loose pussy lips that hang from here to eternity. I'll bet you on that. I'll bet you on that. She's got some hangers, man. She's got some mud flaps, that's for sure. What a low life this bitch is, huh? That's one low life bitch. I'll tell you that. Low life fucking bitch. That's quite the level to be on. Man. Shit, those kind of women, you take your dick out and you piss on them. That's the kind of Filipina that you don't want. Absolutely. I'll call her every fucking name in a fucking book. Bitch, cunt, con artist. Yeah. Yeah. That's what she is. She's an overweight, desperado. She got a big old ass. Dumples. Dumples has a big, big. Ass. All this coming from a creep who gets upset when people mention that his living partner has eight children. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys, thank you guys. Shout out to Brent, shout out to Brandon, shout out to Big E, shout out to shout out, shout out to me, shout out to shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out. Ah, I have PayPal too. Don't forget I have PayPal. She says, I have PayPal, so if you maxed out your credit card, you could always send me PayPal. Let's not forget I have PayPal. Did I say, I, did I remind you that I have PayPal? I'm going to remind you I have PayPal. Yes, I will suck on a lemon now to make more money. I suck on eggplant with peanut butter, make a fool out of myself, but I'm willing to do the challenges to make more money on my show, so now I suck on lemons. I suck on lemons. Here, suck this, baby. Suck this, baby. Yeah, I'll give you something to suck on. 
suck on eggplants, suck on lemons. Here, baby, suck on this. Here, suck on this, why don't you? Suck on this. But you never will, man. You're never going to suck on this. Suck your lemons, because that's all you have. Trash, I tell you, trash. Trash. Here, suck on this, baby. But you're never going to get a chance. I'll give you something to suck. I'll give you something to suck. Yeah. Coming from a man who sang songs about penises with a child. I'll put word out there and you're not going to like the word. I'll make your life miserable, you moron bitch. Call in a Filipina the B word. Not good. Not good. She never said that. You cunt. You fucking cunt. Wowzer. That's what you are. I'll say it. You're a fucking cunt. This is quite the level to avoid, folks. Don't talk about me or my wife ever again, you son of a bitch. You don't have a wife. You wear too much eye makeup. You look like a fucking whore. You talk like a fucking street whore. And you are a piece of trash. Nasty mouth. Nasty attitude. Trash. Shut your fucking mouth, cunt. See you next Tuesday. Because you are a disgusting person. This coming from a man who exposed himself three times on video to get the approval of another man, the acceptance. Some women develop a complex when they're jealous of somebody else. Oh, they're bad. They're ugly. They're not as beautiful as me. Well, first of all, honey, you wish you looked as good as my partner. You only wished. You know who you are. You can't sing. You're ugly as shit. You're the ugliest broad I've ever seen in my entire life. But I will tell you, she's the ugliest, fugliest woman I've ever seen. You're not only ugly, you're fugly. You're the size of a dwarf. You're skinny as a scarecrow. Uh, honey... When pigs can fly, then you'll be more beautiful than my partner. <laughs> Dream on, because that's all you can do. You're a product of a bad birth. Let's face it. You've got to live with your ugly self. Fugly ugly. Fugly ugly. So we could see why an apology was necessary to avoid these levels that... And don't be accusing me of those fucking Facebook things, man. I don't even know... Your monkey face girlfriend's fucking last name. I have no fucking clue, you scumbag. It ain't me. No, it ain't me. Facebook, a wonderful, wonderful platform for social media. A good way to communicate with friends, family, and loved ones. And share some things, sometimes a good laugh. But for this old perverted creep... This old perverted creep went on Facebook making comments about little girls wearing makeup. Why would you even be looking at profiles like that to make comments about little girls? But anyway, folks, we could see why an apology was necessary to avoid getting down to this level. I hope everybody has a great day or a great evening, and I want to thank you for tuning in to Passport TV. Oh, <laughs>